Hello Year 2, I thought I'd read you a story today. I've chosen one called Millie the Meerkat because I thought it's about one of the biomes that we've been learning about. I wonder if you can guess which biome this book is about. Here we go. There was once a young meerkat called Millie who was bored as she sat on an earth mound taking her turn as the lookout. To amuse herself, Millie took a great big breath and barked out, Snake! Snake! A snake is approaching the baby meerkat's burrow! All the other meerkats came running out of their burrows to help Millie drive the snake away. Then about you, I can't see a snake. But when they arrived at the top of the mound, they found no snake. Millie laughed at the sight of their angry faces. Dear. Don't bark snake, Millie, said the other meerkats, if there is no snake. Later that day, Millie was feeling even more bored. And she barked out again, snake, snake, a snake is approaching the baby meerkat's burrow. Think they should believe her? To her mischievous delight, Millie watched as the other meerkats rushed to the mound to help her drive the snake away. But when the other meerkats arrived at the top of the mound, they found no snake. Again, Millie laughed at the sight of their angry faces. Don't bark snake, Millie, repeated the other meerkats. You must only bark snake if there is actually a snake. Later in the afternoon, Millie saw a real snake slithering close to the baby meerkat's burrow. Alarmed, Millie leapt to her feet and barked out as loudly as she could. Snake! Snake! A snake is approaching the baby meerkat's burrow! Do you think they're going to believe her? But the other meerkats just thought that Millie was trying to fool them again. So they didn't come to help her. Outside, as day turned to night, everyone wondered why Millie hadn't returned for supper. They went to look for Millie and found her crying on top of the lookout mound. There really was a snake here. The meerkat babies have scattered. I barked out, snake, snake. As loudly as I could, sobbed Millie. Why didn't you come and help me? A wise old meerkat tried to comfort Millie as they walked back to the village. We'll help you look for the lost meerkat babies, he said, putting his arm around Millie. You have learnt an important lesson today, Millie. Nobody believes a liar, even when they're telling the truth. The entire meerkat colony helped Millie look for the lost babies and once they were all found, they took them up safely in their burrows. Millie was very sorry for what she had done and promised that she would never lie to her family and friends again. Okay, well done if you guess that the biome that was in this story was the desert. Fantastic. Listen out for another story soon. Bye.